On the 4th of May 2013, the 139th Kentucky Derby was run. The horse 2 kilometers only takes 2 minutes, but the winner delivers nearly $1.5 million. For only the second time in the last 92 years there did a black jockey in the race, Kevin Krieger. Remarkable, because in the early years of the race the black jockeys dominated correct. The Kentucky Derby was first held in 1872. In that year Meriwether Lewis Clark Jr. made a trip to England, where he Epsom Derby, founded in 1780, visited. Inspired by the European horse racing, Meriwether decided to return to his hometown of Louisville to collect money for the construction of a racetrack. The complex was soon called Churchill Downs in the vernacular, referring to the former owners of the territory, but only the name was officially adopted in 1937. Before that it was called, the Louisville Jockey Club. The first Kentucky Derby on May 17, 1875 the first race took place. The length was until 1896 one and a half miles 2.4 kilometers, and the distance was shortened to 2 kilometers. The first race was won by the black jockey Oliver Lewis and his horse Aristides. In the first race were 13 of the 15 black and jockeys of the first eight races were won by 15 black men. The success of the black jockeys came from slavery. In the southern states of America slaves were responsible for the care of the horses of their own. When slavery was abolished during the American Civil War, the sport remained popular among the black population. Segregation on the track around the turn of the 20th century the segregation in the U.S. became increasingly intense. At the races in America's black jockeys were hardly any chance of victory. During races, they were in fact pushed by their white competitors on the rails of the track or even beaten with a whip. The organizers looked the other way and the owners of expensive race horses decided no black jockeys to race more. Between 1921 and 2000 did not have any black jockey participating in the run for the roses as the race is also called as a reference to the red roses that the winner gets traditional. Marlon St. Julian, who took part in 2000, and Kevin Krieger are therefore the only black jockeys in the last 92 years who participated in the Kentucky Derby.